This is Total Telecom at the FTTH Council event in Luxembourg. I'm joined by Philip Van Hill, who is the chairman of the Telecoms Group of Europa Cable. Philip, thanks for talking to us at Total Telecom. Can you first of all tell me what Europa Cable actually does? Europa Cable is an association that is the voice of the leading industry in Europe, um, making cables, making passive network equipments, energy and telecom. Uh, employing the members of Europa Cable employ about 70,000 people around the globe, most of them in Europe, um, and have a turnover of about 20 billion euros. So it's a massive industry we're talking about. Now I know you're only the chairman of the telecoms part, but tell us what some of the big issues are. We try to be uh, a representative of this industry, which is by the way one of the few industries where Europe is in the leading seat worldwide and we uh, want to be the voice of that industry towards the political authorities in Brussels in particular but all through Europe in order to make sure that uh, the right choice are made when it's about rolling out the broadband network. Yeah, because there's a big issue with quality here, isn't there? That the market, both electricity and, and telecoms, are being flooded with substandard cables. I think one of the big issues in fibre is we need to put cables in once and once for all, not change it every few years because we bought substandard material. Yeah, I think as a, as a region we are investing currently sub substantial amounts of money globally, collectively, public or private, to build what is the, the infrastructure that we need for the future, it would be a pity not to do it right. And uh, to do it right, we need to consider the quality of what we are putting into the ground um, in terms of cables, in particular, not only cables, but connect connectors, also the, the active equipment that go with it. But I would like to stress the fact that the passive side of the network must be of high quality to be long lasting. And we are wanting, I think collectively wanting to build an infrastructure for Europe that is meant to last at least 20 to 30 years. Yes, and, and in terms of your message, you're not going to get that quality if you just buy the cheapest thing on the planet. Correct. But uh, the cheapest thing usually don't go right with best quality. But I, I would even say that there are enough innovative solutions to make the total investment even cheaper when choosing the right quality. Because, you know, cable and passive equipment are something like 10% of the whole investment. If these cables are able to reduce the rest of the capex, then it's, a, it's winning on both sides, quality and also cost in the end. But the cable is critical. You have a slogan, try life without us, and I think that makes a very good point. Yes, I would say try life without us is our slogan as Europa Cable to say, imagine life without cables. Because we all take cables for granted as something that is basics, that is part of the basics. I would say try life without quality cables uh, to end the discussion because quality must be considered carefully. Okay, well let's hope we don't have to, but in the meantime, thanks very much for talking to us. Thank you, Brian.